Hello guys, so welcome back to another edition of Common Sense with Freddy. Like you know, I am a capacity builder. I am also a certified John Maxwell coach, um, an IT consultant, as well as the founder of a virtual coaching platform, Zid Worldwide. Are you just joining us for the very first time? Please do not forget to smash on the red subscribe button below this video. You see, transitioning into tech industry can be a transformative opportunities for everyone. But you see, for Africans, it's quite challenging. I am one. I'm a Nigerian, like you all know, and I'm in the tech space. And before I joined the tech space about nine years ago, I never had a tech background and there were less opportunities. And while I was coming into the tech space, I was faced with the competition, a stiff competition with my counterpart who had 10, 15, 20 years of experiences. So for Africans, I can tell you that a lot is expected of us. You see, the tech space offers a path to economic empowerment and career advancement. However, this journey demands a high level of focus, determination, and strategic planning. And it is crucial for Africans to understand some basic fundamentals, which would help you understand why you need to put in so much work to be able to bridge that gap because I see it as a war front that you need to conquer. Why? One, navigating educational gaps. Focus learning with varying um, level of access to quality education has been a challenge. African learners must be particularly focused in their approach to acquiring tech skills. Prioritizing self-directing learning through online courses coding boot camps and free resources can help bridge educational gaps. How about continuous skill development? The tech industry evolved rapidly, requiring continuous learning and adaptation. A focused approach to skill development, staying focused with industry trends and mastering in demand technology is essential for staying competitive. Overcoming infrastructural challenges. You see, maximizing resources in regions where internet access and electricity are unreliable. It's crucial to maximize the use of available resources. A focused strategy might include downloading materials for offline study, scheduling work during periods of stable connectivity, seeking out local tech hubs, or co-working space with better infrastructure. Resourcefulness and innovation is another factor to look into why this challenge is um, prevalent because Africans often need to be resourceful in finding workaround to infrastructural challenges. This requires focus on innovative solutions such as leveraging mobile technology or learning and work or collaborating with others to share resources. Now, how about maintaining financial discipline, investing wisely in education? You see, transitioning into tech often requires financial investment in education and tools. A focused financial plan that prioritizes spending on essential courses certifications and equipments can ensure that resources are allocated effectively. Balancing work and learning is another. Many Africans may need to work while studying to transition into tech. Maintaining focus on both work responsibilities and learning goals requires strong time management and discipline. You see, I am a case study in this and i'm able to explain this or share this because this is the part i told this is how i was able to transition into the tech space another one is building a strong professional network targeted network is imminent building a professional network is vital in the tech industry 
focusing on networking with industry professionals, joining tech communities and attending relevant events can open doors to job opportunities, mentorship and collaborations. You see, leveraging social media and online platforms like LinkedIn, GitHub, Twitter are essential tools for building a tech presence. A focused approach to curating your online profile, sharing your work and engaging with others in the industry can significantly boost visibility and opportunities. Another thing I want to talk about is setting clear career goals. Sometimes we fail to, you know, share our clear career goals, defining our paths. You see, this will often and bring a wide range of career paths from software development to data science to UX design. It's important to focus on a specific area of interest. Set clear career goals and tailor your learning and job search efforts accordingly. You see, you need to create a roadmap. A focused career roadmap with short-term and long-term goals can help you stay on track. This includes setting milestones for acquiring specific skills, gaining certifications, or securing internships and job placements. And then how about dealing with societal and cultural pressures? You see, staying focused amid distractions, societal expectations and cultural norms can sometimes divert attentions away from tech careers, especially in regions where traditional professions are more valued. Staying focused on your tech goals despite external pressures is key to success. Fostering a supportive environment, surrounding yourself with supportive community, whether family, friends, or like-minded pairs can help maintain focus and motivation. Sharing your goals and progress with this community can provide encouragement and accountability. Then, have you looked at adapting to global standards, meeting industry expectations. The global tech industry sets high standards for technical skills, communication, and professionalism. A focused approach to meeting these standards through practice, certifications, and feedback is essential for competing on an international level. Cultural competence and communication is also very important. As many tech roles involve working with global teams or clients focus on developing soft skills such as cross-cultural communication, collaborations, and adaptability can make significant difference in your career. So leveraging local opportunities, engaging with local tech ecosystems, why global opportunities are appealing it's also important to focus on local tech ecosystem. Participating in local tech events, contributing to community projects, or joining regional startups can provide valuable experience and connections. Building tech solutions for local challenges, Africans who focus on creating tech solutions that address local challenges can carve out a niche in the market. So this approach not only meets pressing needs, but also positions you as a valuable innovator in your community. How about embracing a growth mindset and persistence in learning? Transitioning into tech is a challenging process that requires persistence. Focusing on maintaining a growth mindset, viewing challenges as opportunities to learn and improve, will help you navigate setbacks and stay committed to your goals. Celebrating small wins is very important. A focused approach to celebrating progress, no matter how small, can keep motivation very high. Recognizing and rewarding your achievements reinforce the importance of your efforts and keep you moving forward. Now, Balancing immediate needs with long-term vision, short-term sacrifices for long-term gains, 
is very paramount and I call it delayed gratification. The journey into tech often requires short-term grat- I mean, sacrifices such as reduced leisure time or lower initial income, focusing on the long-term benefits such as career growth, financial stability, and personal fulfillment can help maintain commitment to the transition, strategic decision-making, making strategic decisions such as choosing the right courses, jobs, or mentors is crucial for a successful transition. A focused approach to decision-making, considering both immediate and future goals will guide you towards sustainable success in tech. In conclusion, transitioning into tech is a demanding journey for Africans, but with focus and determination, the challenge can be overcome by concentrating on education, resource management, networking, and goal setting, aspiring tech professionals can successfully navigate the complexity of this dynamic industry. Focus is not just about hard work, it's about making strategic choices, staying resilient, and continuously pushing towards your goals, even when the path is extremely difficult. With the right focus, Africans can unlock the vast potentials of the tech industry and build rewarding careers that contribute to both personal success and the continent's development. I'm sure this will inspire someone out there and then you would not give up in the journey to transitioning into tech. See you all at the top because the bottom is crowded.